Hey guys, what's up? So today is Displaced Episode 2. We're going to look at Mommy Bay Brewing Company's Blitzen Flavored Ale. Ale brewed with cinnamon, orange, and honey. And this is a 12 ounce or 355 milliliter can. 7.7% alcohol by volume and 20 IBUs. And we have a story. Blitzen, once each year we craft this tasty ale to celebrate the festive holiday season, beginning with a masterful blend of dark and heavy malts brewed with copious amounts of honey. We create a balanced sweetness that defies the spirit of the spear. Spiced with just the right amount of orange and cinnamon, a light hopping rounds out this perfect glass of holiday cheer. When served at 50 to 55 degrees Fahrenheit and enjoyed with friends both old and new, Blitzen Ale is one of life's pleasures that makes the holiday season or holiday time special. And this is from uh, the Mommy Bay Brewing Company, Cincinnati, Ohio, under special agreement with Mommy Bay Brewing Company of Toledo, Ohio. So I'm not certain if this is made in Toledo or if this is made in Cincinnati because, um, well, the Mommy Bay Brewing Company in Toledo is... Uh, is at the Oliver House in uh, downtown Toledo, which is right on the uh, Maumee River. And they have a pretty nice restaurant there. So if, uh, oh, they have a restaurant there and they have a bar and they have a bar there downstairs. So if you ever have a chance to uh, to get there, if you're in the Toledo, Ohio area, do, do check out the Oliver House. Now, either I'm really late or I'm really early with this beer. I don't know, but I found it on the Markdown Rack and, uh, you know, I just thought, well, I just got to have it. <laughs> so let's uh, let's give this puppy a try. And so we've got Christmas in May going on. Hmm. Trying to get a read on this one. Hmm. It's got, um, I can definitely taste a little bit of the honey in it, and I can definitely taste the cinnamon. I'm not tasting too much orange. I mean, it's pretty hoppy. It's pretty hoppy, and if you like a hoppy beer, um, this definitely is one. It's got a decent taste to it, I would say. It's about kind of what I would expect from sort of a holiday, you know, Christmas time, winter time kind of blend. I can't say this beer exactly blows me away. It's not bad, but it's probably not something I would really buy again. Or if they're going to make another brew for 2022, um... I would probably recommend that they work on bringing out more of a uh, a little more of a citrus flavor to it. It's kind of missing some citrus. I mean, honey is fine and everything, but if you put too much in it, if you put too much in it, sometimes it kind of falls flat. Like I've had a couple of other beers with honey in them, and some of them, have, a couple of them have been just fine. But there's been a couple that where it was just a little too much. And it almost tastes like maybe there's just a touch too much in here. So maybe less honey and a little more citrus. But otherwise, it's not bad. Well, guys, that's going to do it for me. I want to thank you so much for watching. Be sure to hit that subscribe button if you haven't done so already. And as always, guys, have a great rest of your day, and I'll see you next time.